Hello everybody. In this lesson series, I'm going to be talking about HTML5's Canvas feature. In this lesson, I'm going to be talking about how to make simple rectangles. And this is just about the simplest shape you can make in Canvas. So, at the top, you can see that I said uh, exclamation mark doc type HTML. And this tells the browser that you're using HTML5 and not an earlier version. So I've created the basic structure for an HTML page. You got HTML, head, title, body, and um, inside the body we have the canvas feature. Uh, inside the canvas we have ID equals canvas1. This is really important for linking JavaScript to Canvas. We set the width and we set the height. Uh, that's also important. Inside here we have your oh, weird. we have your browser does not support Canvas. And this message is displayed when the user's browser obviously does not support Canvas. If it does support Canvas, this message will not be shown. Okay, below this we have um, script type equals text slash JavaScript. Um, this is where all the, the, the Canvas magic is going to be happening. So first what we want to do is we want to create a little shortcut to uh, this Canvas element. So what we want to do is write var Canvas equals get element by ID canvas and that's a little shortcut for the canvas element below this we're gonna write var context equals no actually before this we want to write document uh, that tells it that the element is on the document. So on the context, context variable, you want to say canvas, which is what we wrote up here, dot get context 2D. This is telling, uh, when we write the shapes, we're telling it that the context is two-dimensional and not three-dimensional. Okay, now we want to get into drawing the shapes. So to draw a rectangle, uh, first we're going to want to set the color. You don't have to set the color the because the default color is black, but I want to make this this rectangle blue. So I'm going to say context, which is linking, um, uh, which is the parent for the shapes. And I want to say fill style equals. And here you can either do hex, which is would be this, or you can use RGB, which would be this. Um, it doesn't really matter. It's just like CSS coloring. Now, to draw the actual rectangle, we're going to want to write context dot fill rect. Um, and the first argument is going to be the x coordinates. And I want it to be about 30. This is the y coordinates. The next one is the width. I want it to be 50 pixels by 50 pixels. This is the height. And that's all we need to draw the rectangle. I'm just going to save the document. Open it up in my browser. And you see it uh, draws a blue rectangle, 50 pixels by 50 pixels. Um, that's basically how the canvas works. 
uh, now I actually want to create a a stroke. So I'm going to say context dot stroke stroke style equals this is just like the fill style setting the color red green blue and I want it to be a red outline so I'm going to say 255 by 0 by 0 and then I want to set the the stroke width so I'm going to say context dot stroke width equals 5 and then I want to actually draw the stroke so I'm going to say context dot stroke and this is basically like the fill rectangle except you're not actually filling it with a color so I'm gonna say uh, 30 by 30 by 50 by 50 the same uh, coordinates and size as the filled rectangle I'm gonna save that and refresh and you'll see that it creates a uh, stroke around the rectangle but for some reason it didn't it didn't um change the the width of the stroke and that's because it's not stroke width like most people would think it's actually line width you'll see that it actually does it now so yeah that's the very basics of canvas drawing in my next tutorial, I'll be talking about how to draw a line, which is actually not as simple as you may seem as it may seem. However, once you get the hang of it, you'll be able to draw lines just like a pro. <laughs> okay, thanks for watching. Uh, please watch the next lesson when it comes up. Uh, please rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you again. Bye.